if you're striving for holiness without which no man shall see the Lord, then you are pressing on. All right, you may fall individually, but if you deny God's calling and fall, then you fall away. You're, you're, you are not genuinely converted. You're not genuinely become a child of God. But if you have been genuine, and I believe that as Abraham was genuinely called and genuinely saved, uh, and, and he demonstrated that in his life. So uh, technically, uh, no, it, it is not possible for him to disobey in that sense and to put himself outside of God's grace. No, it, it's possible for him to disobey God. We all do that every time we sin. But what do we do? We fly to Christ for forgiveness. And that's why in the Old Testament they had to repeat the sacrifices, because that's what happened. But now we are in Christ. So, yeah, thank you. That's a that's a, a, a thought provoking question. A good question. Joe jo in from Lipper City, Pastor, just for clarification. When you say the new covenant is better than the old covenant, you say the old covenant is no longer in operation. And the new covenant is new in the sense that the old is gone. I, 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 in a sense, yes, yes, that, that is the case. Not, 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 yes, no, it, in a sense, it's not that it's no longer in operation, but it is, full, it is fulfilled as the Abrahamic covenant built upon the Noahic covenant. As each one builds upon the other foundation, so the new covenant has built upon that foundation, but it overarches it. And in a sense, it if I use the word replace, I, in a sense, it does replace the other covenants because it, because, it, because it is the final fulfillment of God's revelation. But he's been showing us the way all the way through. And surely, if, if you've understood what I've tried to, maybe I haven't made it very clear, but if you tried to understand what I've said today, there it is in embryo in, uh, with Abraham, of course, it's an embryo before. It's an, it's an embryo there in, in Genesis 3.15. But it's more graphically de demonstrated to Ab Abraham as God puts him into a, 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 a trance, as it were, a vision into a deep sleep. And yet Abraham knows what's going on. And God walks between the part. He's symbolizing that. That's the whole thing. Um, so, uh, yeah. So it's, it's not so much... Well, in a sense, it is the new, you know, the old has gone. That's a phrase in, in, in Corinthians, isn't it, in some translations. Um, but it's fulfilled. And I, I much prefer the word fulfillment for um, reasons that probably take too long to say now. But um, it's much better to say that than to say it is gone, to say it is fulfilled. Um, when you fulfill something, you don't necessarily um, um, get rid of it. You don't, it's not necessarily gone. Um, when I come to India or the Philippines, I need a visa. I get a visa. The form is filled out. And because I have fulfilled the terms, they let me into the country. Um, but that doesn't, that, that doesn't remove the requirement for a visa. I haven't abolished the visa system because I fulfilled it. Now, the danger is people think if somebody has fulfilled it, therefore they've abolished it. Um, and when Christ fulfills the law, that doesn't mean he's taken it away and we don't need to follow it anymore. Um, but uh, that doesn't mean to say that. Uh, I hope that gives you something here. Now, good day, Dr. Ian. There are commentaries that assert that Abraham was only converted. What can you say about this? Well, at the end of the day, I, I, I'm. That's that's a, that's an interesting question. I, to some extent. Do you know when you were converted? Well, do you know when you were regenerate? Um, if you understand, uh, read one a, a very, very important, very important book that you really ought to read is this book. It's, I mean, it, it's so important. It's right here on my, just, uh, you know, I know where to look for it. Redemption Accomplished and Applied by John Murray. You need to read that. It's a wonderful book because it tells you about the Ordo Salutis, the order of salvation and the work of work of grace. Now, um, if you, uh, yeah, at the end of the day, who, who knows when somebody is converted? What we need to know is that God, that we are saved, that we are born again. And uh, I, 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 I prayed a prayer and I asked the Lord to be my savior when I was seven years old. And um, I, I've ne he's, he's never let me down. I've let him down lots of times, but he's never let me down. Was I converted then? Was I converted later when I came to full assurance? Who, who knows the precise date? The point is, do, do you remember, well, sometimes I say to people, do you remember the date of your birth? 
Well, no, I, none of us remember the date of our birth. It's, but you are alive, aren't you? At least I hope you're alive. I mean, most of you are just pictures on here, so I can't see whether you're alive or not. <laughs> Sorry. Do you understand? Um, so to some extent, it's, uh, 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 it's, it's an irrelevant question. To some extent, I, uh, please, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, not um, dismissing um, uh, your question. I, I'm just saying, think about this. Um, does it really matter? The fact is, he was God's man, and we know that he was a man of faith because Hebrews 11 tells us. Um, if you want my opinion, I think that he was a, I think he was converted when he obeyed God's call, because that's usually how we define conversion, when people obey God's call. Um, but um, if you feel strongly that it wasn't until Genesis 15, 6, I'm not going to fall out with you. But uh, historically and theologically and according to most understandings of the work of grace, uh, then it is when a man obeys God's call that he uh, demonstrates that he's born again. Um, and in which case then uh, Abraham obeyed God's call in Genesis 12. But I hope that helps. I'm not sure who asked that, I'm sorry. Um, yeah. 